Right guys, this is the kind of post winter, mid winter service on the bike. Um, if you saw the previous video, uh, you would have seen how kind of filthy I let the bike get to be fair. Um, this is just kind of a run through of what I've done to the bike and kind of a close up to see kind of how much cleaner the bike is. I mean, I'm what the strip down I've done, uh, the chain has been replaced with a brand new, um, if it can zoom on there, Dura Ace 9000 chain. Um, I always tend to buy those chains because they're only a couple of quid more than the Ultegra one, so why not get the best for the really the same money, to be fair. Same cassette on there, just obviously giving a decent clean. Um, rear mech taken off, cleaned. I didn't take the jockey wheels off because they were running pretty well, to be fair. Um, but yeah, the rear mech's all cleaned and lubed up, lubed up on there as well. All kind of, once it's been washed and dried, sprayed over with GT85. Front crank, took the cranks off to be fair, check the bearings on the bottom bracket. They were, they're fine, just kind of re-grease them on the outside of their sealed, um, just kind of stop water penetrating. So yeah, they were kind of running smoothly, crank cleaned and slid back in on there. Front mech left on but cleaned and re looped with kind of GT85 in there. Pretty clean to be honest with you. Also changed front and rear brake blocks because they were kind of getting on their last legs with winter riding on there. So the winter service is kind of really more lubrication, checking components, new chain, new brake blocks. I could have changed the bottom bracket bearings because I've got the tool to do it, but they're running fine, so I'll probably change those for next winter. Uh, but what I did find on the bike after cleaning it is this up here on the frame. I'll just let it zoom. There we go. So there's actually a crack it started from the seat stay in the middle there, and it's starting to spread round. Um, I always use a torque wrench to wrench up the saddle, not that I've ever adjusted it in the time I've already had the bike, but the bike's two years old. The bike is actually a felt um, F4, so it's kind of like an entry level road bike, which is why it's my winter bike, been upgraded to DI2. Um, I took pictures, sent it to the online retailer that I bought the bike from, and they're going to do a warranty claim on it. I don't know what will happen, but we'll find out. But the bike has a five year warranty, so I'll keep you posted on that. But that's just an overview of the kind of winter service and it's running you know, real kind of nice and smooth now and the bike cleaned up, ready to go for another kind of three months of winter riding.